Hey guys, what's going on? This is Aaron with Punch the Limit, and today we're doing something a little bit different. You know, I stopped playing Half-Life for the betterment of our channel, but since I have absolutely no idea what to bridge the gap with, uh, I'm just going to be sitting here, I'm going to be throwing random games around, seeing how you guys like it. We're going to see if we're going to make any of these games into a series as of right now. I have Starbound up. Um, I got this game whenever it was early access, and I stopped playing it for a while, but now it's hit its foundation release. It is now an official game out of early access, which is really surprising now that I think about it. There have been games that have been in development for like three to four years that are still in early access. But hey, this one is just a shiny monument of what those games should be but then again i don't even know that I, it's been like a good year or so since i played this anyway that's besides the point let's get into this all right uh i had, did play this earlier with a friend this is my character we're not gonna do this for all intents and purposes i'm going to start a new character all right so let's see here Hmm. We'll just leave that at that. Okay, so I think what's what a peaceful height will greet you sessions. Um I wanna be bird because birds are cool and stuff. Oh, almost take Okay, I like the way that guy looks, except he needs to be absolutely fabulous. Let's random randomize this name. Let's add an eye at the end. Quellily. Yeah, and we're going to play survival because we're not pussies. Alright, so this is going to be a little cutscene, I'm assuming. My fellow protectors, today we come together to witness the protectorates grow. For over 500 years we have stood proud here on Earth, drawing together races of all kinds in the name of peace. Our task to protect our fellow beings, to support house and educate those that seek our aid, and to foster accord between those that aspire to it. Today, in the name of peace, we welcome our newest compatriots compatriots and present them <laughs> with each with our greatest tool the matter manipulator well, what what was that and just like that it turned into a Japanese hentai oh this guy's about to get owned Matter Manipulator, it's not safe to remain here. Please take the Matter Manipulator. You must proceed to the shuttle pod. Everyone is dead. Can I loot these? Nope. They look like the little canisters that you get off the ground. And here we learn how to dig. Okay. No, I do not want to be a part of your anime. I'm sorry. I must decline. I'm really, really glad that I escaped that, uh... That anime. Hey, it's a little bunny. And he loves me. Pretty, pretty bunny bunny. So are these things gonna... These things are... Oh, what the hell? No! Okay, so... I just escaped... A Japanese anime, and now I'm getting attacked by cute little jellyfish. Now I'm gathering coal. Ow! Stop! No! It's too cute to want to do stuff. Like, why? I don't want to hurt it. But. It's making me. It's making me. It's making me do stuff I don't want to do. And I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. Is this thing gonna try to hurt me? Yes, it is. <laughs> what? No! You. You can't do that. I can pick up little flowers. 
Alright, so what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to chop down these trees with this matter manipulator. And I am going to... What is many uses? I suggest you kill additional trees to explore the crafting menu. I mean, that goes far beyond what I want to do right now. It is nighttime. And if this game is anything like all the other survival games out there, as soon as it hits nighttime, you're either outside or you really are a part of that anime. This game's a lot scarier than I remember it being. And, you know, aside from the fact that it added tentacle porn monsters, it just, everything wants to kill you. And I don't know what else I expected, but... Alright, I think I'm gonna expand this and level this out a little bit. Since I'm a bird, I'm gonna make myself a little nest. It's gonna be a fine dance. It's gonna be nice and comfortable. Okay, so... Gathering all this plant fiber. Or plant... What is it? Plant matter? Yeah. Okay, and it's starting to come back to me on how to play this game. Put this campfire down outside. Put this inventor's table right here. Alright, we're getting somewhere. Alright, uh... Let's go ahead and make the rest of this... Timber. And that should let me... Yep, okay. Can I make a door? By any chance? How do I make a door? Yeah, there's no door in there. There we go. Now I can make doors. <laughs> I was afraid I was never going to get it. And I know you guys are probably sitting there like... Just ripping your hair out because you guys know how to play this game. And I just shot all over everything you guys hoped and dreamed and loved because I'm incompetent look at that, this place is getting all nice and cozy alright, this game's really fun it's, uh, it's not much different than whenever I first played it but they have added quite a few things and they've changed stuff around I'm really enjoying it uh, yeah, uh, I'm going to keep playing this, I feel. Hope you guys enjoy it as much as I do. Hold on. Look at you. I'm trying to be all cute looking ass. I'm gonna kick you in the nuts. Ooh, there's more of you. You think your friends are gonna... think you're gonna beat me with your cute little orangey self? You know, I feel like adventuring right now. I feel like that's what this needs. This episode needs a nice little adventure. You know, I haven't gotten to that in seven days to die because I'm too much of a little pussy, but you know what? No. It's time to, you know, nut up or shut up, and we're going to do this. I'm not going to sit here and be a little pansy and wait for my health to go up. I'm going to go. I'm going to make it happen. We're going on an adventure, guys. He's, you know, he's not even worth it. There's gravestone. Gravestones are cool. I don't have any sort of light fixture or anything, so let's go the other way. The other way seems a lot less dangerous. Yellow petals, they're so cute. Ow! I suck. I'm awful. <laughs> 
All right, it's night time. I'm, I'm beginning to realize why there are gravestones everywhere. There are no plant fibers, but there is corn. Oh, you think you're so... Yeah! Get, okay, I have to go back. <laughs> I'm going to die. Alright guys, I'm sorry, I'm reverting back to my old habits of being a complete and utter pansy. And I probably have to end this episode here. Please like and favorite if you enjoyed the video. If you didn't like it, well then you need to just go away. And, uh, you know, I guess you could hit the dislike button, but that would make me really, really sad. And I would probably have to find you. So, um, yeah. Any feedback at all would be very much appreciated, and as always, this has been Aaron with Punch the Lemon. Keep it sweet.